of them. This way, through the alley. Go! He's dead. We're almost there. We're almost there, baby. They're getting through the fence. Damn. Should have brought an umbrella. I like the rain. The only thing around here that feels like home. You think the local law had the sense to put up a tarp? <laughs> if they did, next coffee's on me. Deputy Thornton, I take it. That's me, at your service, ready to get this case solved. He will kill you. After you. By the goddess. What was this place? I don't know. The transmission. The uh, message I found. Doesn't say. Only that a backup might be here. We need to find a way in. So, um, what happened after I... No wonder they tell stories about you. Where's your house? Not far. Come on. This time is different. I mm, we'll have to climb this. You pull me up this time. What? Just kidding. I'll help you. You're too heavy anyway. Huh, how dare you? One day I'll be able to. Whoa, that castle is huge. What do you say? Do we attack it? All right. I'm ready. Now, charge!
They lost it all. Stolen clean away from them, it was every blade of grass. Killed or herded up to the reservations in the middle of nowhere. And how's that different from anywhere else? Well, maybe it's not. I just heard some of the army out here was particularly uh, unpleasant about it. Unpleasant? How do you rob and kill people pleasantly? We don't. In spite of that, just talk. I fear I was perhaps trying to simplify something more complicated for the benefit of our block-headed driver here. Hey, don't blame it on me. Never forget, this here's a con man, Charles, born and bred. Just because it sounds fancy.